What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 60 minute butt, hamstring and abs workout. So grab a heavy set of dumbbells and let's do it. What's up guys, I hope you're ready for this 60 minute workout. We're gonna be targeting the butt, the hamstrings and the abs, okay? Make sure you have a heavy set of dumbbells. I've got my water and my towel and the dumbbells that I'm gonna use today are gonna be 10 pounds. So adjust it to your fitness level. Um, if you wanna step it up a little bit heavier than 10, please do so. Also, if you're looking for heavier dumbbells than you have, make sure you scroll down in the description of this video. I always link the dumbbells that I use, the brand, so you can go there, click the weight that you need and get them sent right to you. So you'll always be prepared. Okay, let's get started with a quick warm up, and then we'll jump right into the workout. We're gonna start with backwards arm swings and one butt kick. Ready? Here we go. Just get the legs warmed up just a little bit. Start with the shoulders. A lot of the uh, moves that we're gonna do today require you to hold your dumbbells at your shoulders or at your switch directions or at your side. So we wanna make sure the arms are warmed up as well. And let's cross your body. And kick, kick, good job. Nice open chest. Good job, three, two, one. All right, let's step it out to the side. I want you to twist and go down to the opposite leg and switch. Face your chest over towards your knee. Get that rotation, get a deep stretch here in your adductor or in the inner thigh. Good, give me just a couple more. One more on this side. Lean, 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 stretch. And one more on this side. All right, good. Hang it down in the middle and I want you to put your hands on your hips. Engaging your glutes, you're gonna hinge forward and back. Reach and squeeze. When you push back, I want you to squeeze your glutes to bring your hips back forward. Good, let's get those glutes activated. You get a little stretch in the hip flexors in the front of your body. Also stretching the hamstrings. I know you guys can feel that. Reach and squeeze. Hold that squeeze for five, four, three, two, one. Great job, all right. Let's stretch out your hamstrings a little bit more. You're gonna stand here in the middle and I want you to swing. Opposite hand touches your toe. Reach, tap out back, reach. Tap. That opposite arm is reaching forward across your body, hitting the toe out front. You can touch out back, or if you're near a wall, you have something stable to hold on to, you can keep that leg swinging. Three, two, and one. Good. We're going to switch legs. Start off just kicking and touching out back. Good. Kick. Kick, touch. Great job. All right, if you've got something to hold on to, give me some swings. If not, just keep kicking and touching. Or you can try swings with just body weight or just the wall, just without the wall, I mean. All right, let's go down deep squat. I want you to push your knees out. So wide angle plie squat. Looks like this from the front. Open up your knees, let's rotate around, open up the hips here. Good, let's go up and down. So how this circuit is gonna work, or this workout is gonna work, we've got three hamstring or glute exercises. We're gonna work for 30 seconds per exercise, okay? After that exercise, you've got 30 seconds of an ab move. Okay, so I'll go ahead and demonstrate your first one. First circuit, single leg Romanian deadlift. Your first 30 on one leg, and then you're gonna do 30 seconds of sit-ups. Come right back up. 30 seconds on the other leg, 30 seconds of sit-ups. And the last one, close squat for 30 seconds, 30 seconds of sit-ups, okay? So each minute is filled with 30 seconds of a leg, glute exercise, 30 seconds of sit-ups. Here we go, let's start at three, two, 
One, first one, single leg Romanian deadlift. 30 seconds right here. Reaching it back. If you need to modify, just take that back leg and keep it on the ground. Make sure your hips are hinging back and forth. Okay? You've got 10 seconds left here. Good. Three, two, one. All right, 30 seconds of sit ups. Let's go. Keeping the dumbbell at your chest. Okay, if you need to modify, just drop the dumbbell down. Whatever challenges you today, I want you to go there. Good job, 10 seconds. That's it, you're coming up in five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, let's go for that opposite leg. Okay, the other leg, Romanian deadlift. Here we go. Good job. That's it. Reach it back, reach the hip, keep the core nice and tight. You've got seven seconds, and we're going down for sit-ups. Three, two, one, let's go. Dumbbell sit-ups or just body weight. If you're doing the dumbbell, make sure that your dumbbell is physically touching your chest. Okay, so what we don't want is here, have you swinging up with the dumbbell. Touch it, make it give you some resistance, and come up with it. Okay, 10 seconds. And you're coming up for close squats. So knees and ankles are together. Three, two, one. Here we go. Close squats. Here. Now this one, you're not gonna come all the way up, okay? So about three quarters of the way up. Dig your heels down. And then I want you to push your hips back, squeeze your glutes on the way up, and go right back down. 10 seconds. Good job, good job. Five, four, two, one. All right, sit ups. Okay, so this circuit that we just finished, that's your first circuit. Okay, we've got two more rounds through it. Great job. That's it, guys. Eight seconds and you're coming back up. Left leg, Romanian deadlift. Three, two, one, come on up. Back to the top, guys, round two. Here we go, single leg. If you're modifying, tap the back toe on the ground and then come back together. Good, reach and squeeze the glute forward. Reach, reach, squeeze it in. You've got five seconds. Going down for sit-ups again. Two, one, come on down. All right, this time on your sit-up, I want you to twist to the left. Okay, coming up, twist, left, down, left. So half of a Russian twist at the top of your sit-up for this round. 10 seconds and you're coming back up for your other leg. Single leg Romanian deadlift. Two, one. Alrighty, let's go. I'm gonna keep you moving today. Whew. Great job. Take your time on these, no need to rush. I'd rather your form be great, you really feel that muscle working, then you rush through it. Keep your hips facing the floor. Good job, you've got five, four, three, two, one. All right, come on back to sit-ups. Remember, twisting to the left on this one, right? Up, twist. Sit up, twist. Good job. Twist. 15 seconds. And you're gonna come up for that close squat pulse. Seven, six, five. Whew. Here we go. Three, two, one. Great work. Come on up. 
Last part of round two, guys. Close squat pulse. Ankles are together, knees are together, and really sit the hips back. Dig your heels down. That's it. From the side, back and back. Squeeze on the way up. Keep that constant glute contraction. Three, two, one. Okay, last round of sit-ups to the left. Here we go, up, twist. Twist, remember, keep that dumbbell on your chest. Whew. Good job. 14, 13. Okay guys, we've got one more round of that circuit. Five seconds, come on up. Four, three, two, one. Okay, left leg, Romanian deadlift, last round. 30 seconds here. That's it, almost there. Keep a nice flat back, a nice tight core. You've got seven seconds. We're going into sit-ups, twisting to the right. Two, one, let's go. Sit up, twist to the right. That's it. Whew. 10 seconds, you're coming up for the other leg. Romanian deadlift, single leg. Five, four, go ahead and come on up. Grab your dumbbells, two, one. Let's go, other leg, and down. Tight core, reach, and squeeze. Think all about your hips. They sit back as your hamstring stretches. Glute activates and brings them forward. Shoulder blades are drawn back, so your back is nice and flat. There you go. Five seconds. Give me one more. And have a seat. Sit up, twist to the right. Whew. Transition time is everything on these circuits, guys. The quicker you get into position, get ready, and start working, the more effective your workout, the more efficient you are at burning calories. Okay, try not to take too many breaks here. Five seconds, and you're coming up for close squat pulses. Three, two, come on up. Whew. Last minute, let's go. Down, halfway. Good. Keep the chest up, keep the butt low. 15 seconds, and you've got your last round of sit-ups with a twist to the right. Five, four, one more glute squeeze. Three, two, one. There we go. All right, last round. Sit up, twist to the right. Here we go. That's it, almost there. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and rest. Amazing job, guys. Whew. All righty. Grab some water. You're doing great. Whew. First circuit down. All right. Next thing we have is an ab circuit, abs only. Okay, so you've got one minute straight of three exercises. No breaks again. All right, here we go. I'll show you and we'll go together. The first one is gonna be a sit up with your feet elevated. Okay, so you're gonna come up, tap your heels inside and outside. Okay, keep alternating those two for one minute. Second one, you're gonna go one leg, twist and hold and reach. So you're gonna twist over one leg, the other leg is reaching in, out, in, out. Okay, second or third minute, the exact opposite of that. Okay, let's start with our sit-ups. Two, one, here we go. 
outside and inside. So you're opening your legs to go inside, close them when you reach outside. Modification, drop the feet, tap outside of your calves, inside of your calves. Okay? One minute, go with me here. In and out, and I want you to control it up and control it down. That's it, 15 seconds. Ten, nine, five, four, three. Come on up. I'll show you how to get ready for the next one. Here, next minute. Take one knee up off the ground, twist towards it. You're gonna reach and tuck that other knee. So you're staying in this half Russian twist position on this side. You can hold your knee here. Make sure you're not holding yourself up, right? Just hold on to it. Punch that other foot out, in, out, in. If you need to modify, place this foot down, keep rocking. That's it. Good, keep that twist. 20 seconds. Burn so fast, right? Woo! 18, 17. Stay twisted. Whew, keep that chest open. Almost there. 10, 9, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. No breaks. Switch right into the other leg. I'm just going to twist around. You just flip directions. Here we go. Reach. Good. I'm rotated over towards my bent knee. If you need to modify, place that leg down. Open, close. There we go. Almost there. 30 seconds. Twenty. Good job, guys. Reach and tuck. Feel this in your lower abs. Pull it in. 14, 13. Whew. Keep that twist, even if you need to drop your foot. That's okay. Twist it over. Reach, tuck. Reach, tuck. Three, two, one. And rest. Ah, great job. Okay, 30 seconds rest. Grab some water. Going on to our next circuit. Whew. Same thing we're gonna do. 40 seconds of work this time, 20 seconds of abs, all right? Your first move, you're gonna take your dumbbells, place them on the back part of your shoulders. Looks like this, okay? We're gonna go sumo, good morning. So think of like a Romanian deadlift, you're going back and forth. Ready? Let's go. Squeeze the hips forward. Reach and squeeze. Nice flat back. Reach, squeeze it together. Right to the front. Your ab movement for this one is gonna be a seated tuck. So you can have a seat on the floor in 10 seconds. Two, one, come on down. Whoops. For your ab move, you're gonna tuck and open. Tuck, open. Five, four, three, two, one. Come on up, great job. Same thing for two more rounds, okay? We'll just keep it simple here. Sumo, good morning. Sumo, wide legs, reach the hips back, squeeze the glutes forward. Reach, 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 squeeze them together. Fully extend your hips. I want you to come all the way up straight. That's it. Good, 10 seconds, you're going back to seated tucks. Good, five, 
five, four, give me one more, two, one, great job, come on down. Seated tucks for 20, tuck, open, tuck, open. If you need to modify, tuck, reach your legs out, tuck, reach your legs out, okay? Just tap on the ground if you need to. Three, two, and one, last round of these guys, come on up. Dumbbells are on the back of your shoulders. Reach, squeeze. From the side, you'll notice my head is looking down at the ground when I go down, looks forward when I'm up. So you're not craning your neck here. It's down, it's neutral with your spine. Okay, 10 seconds, you got your last round of tucks. That's it. Three, two, one. Let's go. Come on down. Seated tuck. Here we go. Tuck open. Tuck open. Good. Three, two, one. And rest. Come on up. Grab onto your dumbbells. We're going to go curtsy lunge. Okay? One leg at a time, stay on that same side. Here we go. Okay, you're stepping backwards and diagonal, and then coming back up to the top, just to tap your foot and bring it right back down. Both knees are bent, 90 degrees. And you're going back to your seated tucks in 10 seconds. A little more leg work on this one. 40 seconds of work here. Two, one. All right, come on down. Seated tuck. Whew. Abs in, booty today. Ah, you guys are doing great. Tuck, open, tuck, open. That's it. Four, three, two, one. We're going back to the same side. All right, curtsy lunge. Take it low, tap low. Tap. Dig that front heel down. I want you focusing on coming right up on top of your front leg. Hips are facing forward. That's it. Dig that heel down. Come on. 15 seconds. Good. Come on. Nine, eight, seven. Two, one, good job. Seated tuck, come on down. 20 seconds, let's go. Tuck, open, tuck, open. Now do whatever you need to on this tuck. If you need to go out, touch your heels so that you control it, that's okay. Do that, stay with me, and rest. One more round through the curtsy lunges. We got this, guys, come on. Whew. I know I'm keeping you guys moving. You can do this though, okay? These strength days, I wanna challenge you to keep your heart rate up. Okay, that's why I don't have a lot of rest time. Still wanna get you a great calorie burn while giving you an effective strength workout. So I'm gonna try to not let you sit for too long. Transition times are everything. Okay, the faster we move through to the next one, the more efficient this workout is. Two, one, let's go. Seated tucks. Here we go. Next time you come up, you're gonna curtsy lunge the opposite way, okay? Good job, two, one. Let's go back to curtsy lunges. We're swinging to the other side. and deep, staying right up on top of that front leg, down, good, front leg is rocking, right, Whew. you're doing great, dig the heel down, make sure your knee stays right in line with your toe, not over it, but going in the same direction, okay, so it's not here, it's not in, 
Five seconds. If you're going down for seated tucks, two, one, come on down. Let's do it, keep rocking. Here we go, tuck, open, tuck, open. Good work guys, three, two, one. Grab your dumbbells, round two of curtsy lunge on this side. You've got three rounds total. Let's keep rocking all the way through. You'll get some rest after this, I promise. Whew. That's it. 20 seconds now. Down, up, really dig that heel in. Whew. Reach back with that back leg. Make sure you're not crowding yourself up front. Give yourself space. Reach back. Four, three, two, one. Come on down. Whew. 20 seconds. Tuck. Open. Breathe on these guys. Five, four, two, one. One last round of curtsy lunges. Let's do it together. I'm right here with you. I'm short of breath as well. I know you can do it. I literally empathize with you right now. I know how you feel. These workouts are not easy, but know that you're not alone. Okay, you've got me, as always. <laughs> and you've got a community of people all over the world that you don't even know doing this workout right along with you. So that should pump you up in itself, right? 10 seconds, eight, seven, four, three, two, one. Last round of seated tucks for 20, then we'll rest. Come on, keep rocking with me for eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one. And you've got 30 seconds rest. Stay down here with me, guys. We're going right into our three minute ab circuit. All righty. Move your dumbbells out of the way. You won't need those. Okay, 10 seconds. Your first minute, it's gonna be a seated tuck with one leg at a time. So you're gonna come up, tuck, switch, Tuck, switch, okay? Ready, let's go. Tuck, switch, tuck, switch. Now if you want to step this up, you can leave that other leg off the ground whew, as you reach forward. It's up to you. If you can pull your lower belly down, keep that back flat, let's do it. If your lower back starts arching, put that foot down. Great job, 30 seconds. And by the way, if you have your feet up, you can go as high as you need to. Tuck, raise it up a little higher. Seven, six, five, three, two, one. Lay it back, keep your heels up. We're gonna go heel, sorry, keep your heels down. Heel taps, left, right, left, right. <sighs> sorry, choked on my spit there for a second. <laughs> oh, sorry. This is how you know this channel is completely real and raw and unedited. Your trainer is choking on her spit. <laughs> you guys are doing great. Keep rocking. Keep that shoulder blades crunched up so your belly is engaged. Squeeze, oblique. Oblique. It would make me feel a lot better if someone at least commented and said they too choked on their spit today. Do you have any mercy for me? I'm just kidding. <laughs> you don't have to do that. Whew. Almost there. 12, 11, 10, 7, 6, 5, 3, 2, one, your last minute of this one. Hip raises, 
Hands are down on your mat. Your legs are up. You're going to lift and lower. Try not to swing your feet too far past your hips and then up, okay? Try to keep them going straight up in the air. Even if it's just a little pop, the less swing you have, the more work for your lower abs. Think heels to the ceiling. Try and press into the floor really hard. Drive your heels straight up without swinging. You've got 30 seconds. That's it, come on, up, relax. Control it down as well. Press up, 10 seconds, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, come on up, grab some water. Towel off if you need to. You're doing great, guys. We are over halfway through this workout. Whew. All righty, we're going back to legs and abs. Okay, we're sticking with the 40 and 20 again on this one, just like last time. So we're gonna grab one dumbbell. We're gonna go reverse lunge to close squat, okay? Looks like this. I'll do it this way. So reverse lunge, see how you're down? You're gonna stay down and tap that foot up, okay? Lunge, tap, lunge, tap. Okay, we're gonna go in 15 seconds together. We're gonna stay on one side for the whole 40 seconds, and then we're gonna drop down and do butterfly crunches. Okay, where your feet are together, legs are open. All right, here we go. Seven seconds, big deep breath for me. Let's drop it down. Two, one, reverse lunge, close. Reverse, close. Take your time here. I want you to stay down and balanced. And if you need to modify, you can step up and down when you come up to the squat, okay? Lunge, close, stand, if you need that option. There you go. We've got nine, eight, seven, five, four, three, two, one. Watch me, feet are together. You're bringing your legs up and down. Up, down, keep the soles of your shoes together. Lift your lower belly. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, come on up, switch legs. Okay, so we're lunging. You're down, lunge, same thing, just opposite legs. Stay low, reach, squat, reach, squat. If you need to modify, lunge and stand. Down, lunge, squat, stand. Okay, if you need that modification, it's there for you. Stay low, dig that heel down. You've got seven, six, five, Going back to butterfly crunches. Two, one, come on down. Soles of your shoes are together. Let's lift up, down. Keep the knees open. If you need a modification, keep your knees together. And just crunch up to your, um, to your chest. That's it, and rest. Okay, third exercise here. We're gonna go Romanian deadlifts. Close legs, both legs together, okay? Dumbbells are outside your legs. Reach and squeeze. Really give me that good glute squeeze at the top. Stretch, squeeze together. Nice flat back. Shoulder blades are pinched together. Head is neutral. Two, one, okay. Come on down, butterfly sit-ups again. Feet together, raise them up. Think lower belly, pull it up. Also control it down. Two, one, okay. 
back to the top. Reverse lunge, close squat, round two. Here we go. Whew. Dig that front heel down, down, down. I really want you to push into the floor so you really feel that glute being activated. Okay, do you feel it? You're really gonna work your butt here if you push down hard into the floor with your heel. Let's go, keep rocking. We've got 12, 11. Go, go, go. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop it down. Woo. Butterfly sit-ups, let's go. Crunch up and down, up, down. Good job. Woo. Three, two, one. Okay, back up the other leg. Woo, these burn. All right, let's go down. Lunge. Whoops. Lunge, close squat. Dig the right heel or the front leg heel, whatever one you're using. Dig it down into the ground. Side doesn't matter. You just keep rocking. And whenever leg you're on, push that heel to the floor in the front leg. Let's go. Huh. 10 seconds. Go lunge, squat. Woo, we got four, three, two, one. Rest. Woo. Okay, butterflies, let's go. Lower belly pulls down. You control it down as well. That's it, come on lower belly. Three, two, one. Grab both dumbbells. You're back to the close Romanian deadlift. Pin your legs together, reach the hips, squeeze the glutes. Think about shutting your car door with your butt, right? How you push it back. Keep doing that, push back. Squeeze forward. Seven, six, five, two, one. Butterfly sit ups. Let's do it. And we've got one more round, guys. You're doing great. Keep rocking with me. Big deep breath. Here we go. Keep going. Pull that lower belly up like you're trying to tuck your knees into your armpits. And then control it down. Rest. Whew. Last round, let's go. Here we go. Going into a lunge. Stay down. Tap, lunge, tap, lunge. Think of the outer booty on that front leg. Keep your knee out, don't let it cave in. Okay, so if I'm here, don't let your knee go in. Keep it out. Eight, seven, six, come on. Dig the heel down, four, three, two, one. Great job. Butterfly sit-ups. We're almost done with this circuit, guys. I know this is a tough one. We've got it, we're in it together. Good, tuck your knees up into your armpits. You can also hold your hands behind your head. Wherever is comfortable for you. Behind your head, down by your hips. Rest. Whatever position works for you, just make sure you're pulling that lower belly in. All right, let's lunge, lunge. Opposite leg. Last time you'll do these today. I know it burns, guys. I'm right here with you. I can literally feel your burn right now. I feel your pain completely, but we got this. We're better for it. We're stronger today. Whew. Let's go 10, nine, eight, stay down. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh my gosh. Okay, butterfly sit-ups. Let's go up, down. Up, down. Two, one. 
Come on up for your last round of close Romanian deadlifts. Here we go. Legs are close, heels are together. Reach, squeeze forward. job. 10 seconds. You've got one more round of 20 seconds. Two, one. Come on down. Butterfly. Sit-ups go up, down, up, down. Good. 10 seconds. Up, down, up, down. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one and rest. Woo. Amazing job. You can actually stay down here on your mat for this one. This next one coming up. Woo. Alrighty. Three minute abs. We're back again. Alright. So we're going for Big deep breath. <laughs> Lay it on down. You're going to go butterfly crunch keeping your feet down, okay? Looks like this. Tap the heel and up. Come with me. I'm really working on your lower abs this week, guys. I know we did these a couple days ago. I really wanna focus on that lower belly this week. So we're doing a lot of moves where you bring your legs up to you or you have your hips open like this to really hone in on the abs right around the belly button. Good job. You've got 20 seconds, and then you're gonna flip your knees over together to the left. We're gonna go side crunches after this. Whew. Come on, seven, six, three, two, one. Knees together, flip them over to the side. You're gonna go out with that top leg. Up, down, up, down. So you're really crunching the obliques here. Okay, that bottom arm is straight out in front of your chest. Scoot back a little so you can see here. Bottom arm is here. And I want you to keep your chest facing forward. That's it, if you need a modification here, just give me a good crunch. If you can't get up off the ground, think about getting your hips to your ribs, okay? <sighs> 15 seconds, you know what's coming. We're flipping to the other side. Whew. Nine, eight, seven. Now you guys can just roll on over to the other side. Same thing, two, one, I'm gonna flip around here so you're not looking at my back. Whew. All right, same thing. Side crunch. Now bottom leg doesn't matter too much if it's bent or if it's straight, as long as you can keep balance. Up, relax, up, relax. That's it, we've got 30 seconds. Come on, crunch and down. Crunch, drop down, drop down. Great job, 20. Here we go, 15. Keep your chest facing forward. Come up to the side, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven. Almost there, three, two, one, whoo, amazing job. Good work, you're gonna stay down here on your mat. Bring your dumbbells in a little bit closer to you so they're about a foot away from the edge of the mat. All right, you're gonna place your toes on top of the handles of your dumbbell, okay? Whew. All right, in 10 seconds, we're gonna go together, single leg tap overs, okay? So I'm gonna bridge up, take one leg, Tap my heel out front, 
and then tap it back on my dumb, on my dumbbell. Okay, ready? Let's go. Tap. Whoops. Keep going. Tap. Toe. Heel. Toe. Heel. Toe to the metal. Heel over top. So this other leg is bridging. It's taking all the weight of your body. Tap your toe. Tap your heel. If you need a modification here, just go up and down, up and down. Okay? Four, three, two, one. Raise your legs up overhead. Toe touches. 20 seconds. Now when you're done with this 20, you're gonna bridge up with the other leg. Tap your other foot over and back. Three, two, one. Toes on the silver. Bridge, heel tap, toe tap. Heel, toe, heel, toe. Hands are down by your hips. Keep those hips up. You're forcing this other leg, the heel of it, into the ground hard to work that butt and the hamstring. Over, back, 20 seconds. Back, over, back. Another modification would be just to lift here, okay? Whatever you need to do, try and isolate one leg at a time. Three, two, one, legs up. Here we go, toe touches. Reach high, four, three, two. Bring the soles of your shoes together. They're on the ground, you're pulsing up, down. Frog pumps for 40 seconds. Dig the sides of your shoe into the floor. Squeeze that butt. If you wanna step it up, you can always place dumbbells on your hips. There you go. Good job. This is a tough one. You really feel it underneath, right? Come on. Eight, seven. We're back up to toe touches in four, three, two, one, whew, legs up, toe touches. Let's go, up, up, up. Stay focused. This is your last leg strength circuit, guys. Stay with me here, five, four, three, two. All right, toes on the metal, bridge up. One leg, over, back, over, back. Great job, tap. Over and back, over and back. Doesn't matter which leg you're using, just keep that butt in the air. Reach, touch, reach, touch. Keep it up, up, up. Hips are to the ceiling. Let's go, back, over, back, over. 10 seconds, hips are higher. Let's go, up, down, up, down. Three, two, one. Legs up, woo! Toe touches. Let's go. Come on. Breathe. I need you to breathe. Five, four, three, two, one. Toes are back on the silver. Here we go. Bridge it up. Reach back. Reach back. Get that leg all the way extended and then touch back behind your dumbbell. Over, back, over, back. Your hands are down by your heels or by your hips. Keeping those legs up, or keeping those hips up, I mean. Let's go, reach even higher with your hips. You've got 15 seconds. Dig that heel down. You feel it right below your butt? Yes, come on. Four, three, two, one. Whew. Rest, legs up, toe touch. Let's go. Up, 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 up. Come on. Okay, after this, you've got frog pumps. So the soles of your shoes are together. Two, 
One. Here we go. Bridge up. Go up and down. Go up, two, down. One, two, tap. One, two, tap. Hold high. Squeeze down. Squeeze down. That's it. Dig the heels into the floor. Up, 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 down. Squeeze down. Here we go. We've got ten, nine, eight, five, four, three, two, one. Toe touches. Last part of round two. Right here. That means you've got one more time through each of those three. What else does that mean? You have the option throughout the whole next three minutes to place a dumbbell on your hip at any time, okay? Three, two, one. I'm gonna do that, okay? Toe is on the one that's still on the ground. Hip is here. Reach back, reach back. So you wanna put it on the side where your toe is on the dumbbell because that's where all the support is. If that's an option for you. If not, just keep rocking. Reach, tap, reach, tap. Keep the hips up, up, up. Whew. Come on, even higher. 10 seconds. Whew. Work, work, work. Even if it's shaking like mine. Let's go, push through the shake. Two, one, rest. You're back up into toe touches. Let's go. Up, down, up, down. Whew. Up, up, up. Seven, six, five, whew, three, two, one. Let's switch sides. Toe on the silver, dumbbell on that same hip. Bridge it up. Reach, tuck, reach, tuck. Hips are up, up, up. Press that heel down into the floor. Even harder now. Let's go. Up, up. 15 seconds, don't drop, don't drop. Hold it high. Let's go, we've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one. Toe touches, let's go. Up, down, up, down. 10 seconds, you've got your frog pumps. Same thing, the option is there to put the dumbbell on your hips. Two, one, let's go. Feet are together. Come with me if you can. Squeeze hard, come on. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Last 20 seconds of glutes today, right here. Scoot your heels in closer to your butt if you want to make it a little harder. Woo. <laughs> Bridge up, come on, up. Up, 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 up. Four, three, two, one. Toe touches, let's go. 20 seconds. Up, down, up, down. Seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. <sighs> rest. You've got 30 seconds rest and all that we have left is an ab circuit, okay? We're gonna close it out with that core, really shredding your abs up today. I know they are tired. We gave them a day's rest. If you're following the week of workouts this week, yesterday we did back and buys and cardio, so no abs there. All right, five seconds. Come on down. Your move is jackknives. One leg at a time. Let's go. One minute here. Modification. Crunch to one leg. Okay, if you can't sit all the way up, crunch and relax. Okay, 
Okay, 30 seconds left. You have the option now to make it a little tougher. Reach that other hand back across the back of your body. Okay, looks like this. Twist, up, twist, up. You know I'm always gonna give you a way to step it up at the end, right? Twist, twist, twist. Five seconds, four, three, stay up on the next one and rest. Your next minute, rope pulls. You're leaning back. You're gonna pull that rope down, reach, pull, reach, pull. Okay, if you need to modify, keep your heels down. Reach, pull, reach, pull. Grab it, pull it down. <sighs> Grab it high. You're trying to get as close to the ceiling as you can. Grab it, pull right down to your side. <sighs> Grab, pull down. 30 seconds. If you have your feet down, try and raise them up. Let's keep going. Grab, pull. Grab, pull. Whew. Come on. We got it, we got it. Push and breathe. <sighs> Grab it way up close to the ceiling. Even closer. Give me one more. Rest. Come on over. Plank position. Whew. Your last minute. Plank hip taps. This is gonna be a tough one. You are tougher. Here we go. Forearm plank. You're rolling your feet to the side. Touch one hip, touch the other. Stack your feet up on each side. When you roll over, your feet are right on top of each other, okay? Last 30. Pull, pull, pull. That's it. 15 seconds. Whew. Seven, six, five, two, one, and rest. Whew. Take a couple big deep breaths. I'm right here with you guys. I know how that felt. Okay, place your hands on the ground. Come into a tabletop position. And I want you to just breathe for a second, okay? Good, take the weight off of your um, upper body and just let your lungs fill up and deflate. Okay, now sit back, butt onto your calves. We're cooling it down, guys. Whew. Catch your breath. Walk your fingertips over, over, over to one side. Feel that stretch along the side body where your ribs are, your obliques are, even the back of your shoulder and your arm. You cross it over. Okay, walk your hands back to the middle and then back over to the other side. Feel that stretch. Yeah, there you go, walk it over. I want you to feel the stretch all along your side. So your obliques, your ribs, shoulder, triceps. There you go. Now bring it back to the front. Pop up into that all four position again and drop your hips down. Feet are nice and wide. Just resting on your thighs here and then push up and away so we can stretch those abs out. If you're like me, you definitely feel it in your lower abs right now. We did a lot of lower ab work today. We did a lot of ab work in general today. All right, tuck your toes down, and I want you to pop your hips up. Drop your heels down to the ground as close as you can. Keep walking your hands back to your feet. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Keep your legs straight as long as you can. Get back to your legs and just stay here for a second. 
Stretch those hamstrings out. Grab onto your elbows, relax your neck. And just think about what you accomplished today. That was a tough workout. You made it. You did not make an excuse to do something else. Everyone is busy, right? Everyone has the option to do other things. Slowly roll it up one vertebrae at a time. That goes for everyone, right? But you made this a priority today. You came here, you showed up, you rocked it. You're sweating like crazy, like me, right? <sighs> and I wanna thank you guys for being here, for giving yourself the privilege of health, of fitness, okay? Of making it to this workout because it's totally accessible, right? You didn't have to leave your house or you didn't have to go to the gym not knowing what to do, all right? You show up. You work out with me, I want you to feel like you're working out with a trainer one-on-one, -on -one, a trainer who is relatable, a trainer who enjoys having you here, all right? And I'm so proud of you guys. I'm genuinely thankful for you and proud of you for coming here, showing up, making this a priority in your day. I always really emphasize that. You came here and that is huge. You rocked it out and crushed it. That is also huge. I want you guys to know how much I appreciate you together. We are at over 8,400 subs, subscribers, and we're just over 3.5 million minutes viewed. I love it, I cannot thank you enough. I wanna keep updating you guys because I feel like it's important that you feel that you're a part of a community that's growing, okay? You're a part of the tribe, you're a part of Sydney Squad, right? Hashtag Sydney Squad, too soon, maybe? Okay, if not, maybe we'll start it someday. But um, I just wanna thank you so much. If you guys would scroll down in the description of this video, check out the sales that I have going on for you on my website. We have fully restocked apparel, and I have half off of that, as well as my 30-day transformation program. Massive program with nutrition, workout videos, gym programs. They're a little different than the ones I offer here on my channel, so if you feel called to support that way, that's there. Um, also, if you feel called to support another way, there's options in the description of this video. And I don't expect that at all. I just have had a couple people ask me, how else can we support you? We're so thankful for this channel. It's a part of our everyday life now and a part of my family's everyday life. So if you feel called to support it, like I said, I don't expect it. There are links there for you to take advantage of that, okay? Thank you guys so much and I cannot wait to keep rocking on this week with you with isolation days, cardio and core, different isolation muscle groups. So wait for tomorrow, I cannot wait to see you. Make sure you like this video if you liked it and click subscribe before you head out and we can keep on growing as a community, guys. Have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow.